what's going on everybody? Franchise kicks coming to you. What? Coming to you with a brand new video. Royal Ones. The Jordan 1 Royals. We are 10 days away from those bad boys dropping. I know that's going to be one of the most hyped releases for Jordan brand of 2017. In my opinion, uh, pending what surprises Jordan brand has for the rest of the year, this might be the drop of the year for Jordan brand. The, uh, the quality on these Jordan 1 Royals looks comparable to the bread ones that came out in 2016. Some people who actually have gotten this pair in hand early have said that it is the leather quality is comparable to the Shattered Backboard version 1. And if that is accurate, then the leather on these Royal Ones are going to be sick. I haven't heard production numbers yet for this shoe, but I would expect Jordan Brand to pump out a lot of pairs just like last year Bread Ones. They weren't really that difficult to get. If you wanted to get at least one pair, you were more than likely you could get one pair because they dropped all over the world. Um, I don't like the bread ones last year on release day. I easily copped off of Nike. I copped off of Foot Locker and I think like End Clothing. They all manually. And I could have gotten more, but I stopped at three because I didn't. I don't know, that's all I wanted. I should have gotten more. Because, you know, the value for them now are like 250 300 But whatever. It's all good. But everybody that wanted a pair was able to get a pair. It seemed like plus multiples. So hopefully the Royals are going to be made in the same kind of numbers as... The hell is that? That you, John Wayne? Is this me? So, I kind of lost my train of thought. But, yeah, if you want a pair... You should be able to get a pair, and uh, if not, resale on the first day shouldn't be much more than 225 250 Early release pairs, I'm seeing people charge like 400 bucks for early release pairs, and I'm like, <laughs> just wait till release day to get your pair. I know there's been several YouTubers who have paid you know upwards of 400 bucks to get a pair early to review to their subscribers. Uh, but that's only because they'll get more views and quicker views and the monetary gain through the YouTube. Though they did it just to get more money from the video. I'm not paying four hundred dollars to get early pair roll ones just to make you know forty bucks on the video. I'll wait till release day. So um, heads up. Tomorrow, Thursday, I will be doing my giveaway for the Redwall Studios hoodie that I uh, shot last week and showed everybody. Hopefully you watched that video to see how you enter into the giveaway, but I'll leave a link up here right now to that video where I'm talking about the giveaway. Um, all you gotta do to enter into the video or to the giveaway is watch the video figure out what you have to do to win this uh pretty much you just go to the redwall.com which is the website for redwall studios you research three artists that have recorded at redwall studios which is based in san jose california and the comments to that video not this one to that video along with your twitter handle and you'll be entered into the giveaway tomorrow. I will do the official randomizer and one subscriber will win this cool ass hoodie. And if you do not win and you want this hoodie, they do sell them on their website. I will leave a link below in the description box to this video, a direct link to buy this hoodie. But it's sweet as hell and uh, good luck. So you got one day left to enter in to that giveaway. If I wanted to unbox one pair of shoes really quick, it's a pair we've actually already seen before on this channel, but um, the prices for this shoe, the retail price has plummeted. But this shoe is available right now at finishline.com for 149 
I think 98. If you use promo code 10 green 100s, that's one zero, the word green and then one zero zero, it'll give you $10 off of the order for that. Then if you have a finish line winner circle reward $20 off, use that and you'll get this pair. Like I got it for a hundred and thirty-five dollars shipped from finish line. So it's had to pay sales tax. Okay, the actual amount shipped for sales tax was one nineteen. Indiana charged sales tax, so it was one hundred thirty-five dollars shipped. When the retail price on this freaking shoe is two hundred twenty-five dollars, and yes, you guessed it. It is the All-Star 6s, the Chameleon 6s, whatever you want to call them. The prices on this shoe have gotten insanely affordable. I wouldn't call it cheap, affordable. I've already got my pair right here. I actually wore them last weekend. So you can get these right now for $135 shipped from Finish Line. On day of release, these, these were $225. Plus finish line shipping was like $6.99. So plus sales tax, you're looking at about $240 ship day of release, including finish line, Nike Airplay sales. Right now you get these under $100, uh, under the original price shipped. So fantastic deal. A lot of people don't like this shoe. I don't know why. It is a dope ass shoe. Very original and I love it. My pair right here, I bought from Nike. Uh, what what I pay for that? I don't remember now. I shot the video. It was like what 158 shipped, I think 160 shipped. So I got my double up. I'm gonna go ahead and keep the pair from Nike. I've already worn them. This pair I'll just throw into the closet and forget about it. And we'll see what the price does here in a few years on this shoe. And if it drops again, even lower on Finishline.com. Pick up another pair, you know, you can't beat $135 shipped for a premium quality shoe. So check it out before the sale ends or before they sell out. Recap, tomorrow is the giveaway, so do not miss out on it. Um, I linked the video earlier in this video of how to enter through that video. If you want to get this, good luck. Um, this will be my only giveaway for March. I do have in a new sample of Franchise Kicks t-shirts. It is all white and it has my new logo on the shirt. That I just got in a couple days ago and I like it. So I will show that shirt. Actually, I'll do it right now. The first one made, I got back from my printer. I like it in front of the shirt. It's got your Franchise Kicks. back of the shirt you've got the logo again that's a little bit bigger and then a link to my youtube channel so i'm actually going to give a few of these t-shirts away next month in april and i'll probably do it with another kind of the same kind of a giveaway as i'm doing this month i'm thinking about five t-shirts so right now i haven't like mass bought these so if you win, what I'll do, I'll, I'll hit you up and say what size. If you're a size large, I will contact my printer, make up a size large. Let's say all five winners are size large. I'll print them up, and then I will have them actually sent to your house from the printer uh, in your size. So it might take a couple weeks for you to actually get them because, like I said, this is the only one I have in hand. I just kind of wanted to see the quality of the shirt and everything. So uh, hopefully, eh, you like it. M my wife likes it. She actually wants me to order her one. So that would be the giveaway for next month. What? Can't talk right now. What? So that would be the giveaway for next month. So be on the lookout for that. It's giveaway season, let's say. So if you enjoyed this video, I rambled on for a little bit. Showed you another pair of shoes you've already seen. Who gives a crap? But it's a good deal. So pay attention tomorrow for the video. 
The official giveaway video is tomorrow. Enter in tonight if you want to win this badass hoodie. So thanks for watching. Subscribe to my channel. Comment below any kind of hatred or like. It's up to you. And I'll see you later. Run.